young man. Hmm? You say you want to enroll your child in my school. I'm not his child, though. You're not my father. He's my uncle. <laughs> shut up, shut up. He didn't ask you anything. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. Okay. What's your name, sir? Sir, it means that he's doing admission. It's not him. Oh. It means that he's supposed to be asking me. My friend, will you shut up? <laughs> Am I talking to you? Is that how you behave? <laughs> Please. Young man, what's the name? <laughs> My name is K. Brown. Mm. And young lady, what's your name? My name is Auntie Sources. <laughs> Auntie what? <laughs> My name is Auntie Sources now. Auntie what? No, come this way. Come this way. Come this way. My friend, I say, come this way. Don't no, look at me. Look at me in the eyes. <laughs> what is your name? I say, you tad bull. My name is Sources, man. <laughs> Next time, if I ask a question, make sure you answer accordingly. Do you hear me? My friend, will you go back there? Come on, come on, will you move it? Young man, please. May I know why she's leaving her former school? You are fired! <laughs> you are fired! You are fired! Hey. You are fired! You are also fired! <laughs> you are fired! Hey! Because my principal sucked my teachers. Huh? Why did you do that? I don't know. Anyways, anyways. It's a good thing you people are here. You see, this school is not an ordinary institution. This is a citadel of learning. Where brains are being harvested, here kids are being polished. And they are given a good academic structuring and are prepared to be the leaders of tomorrow as they have been promised. So it's a good thing you brought her here. Normally, I would have just handed you over this uh, form to fill. But first, I need to know her academic capacity and how sound her IQ is to see if she can fit it to the level she's applying for. Eh? <laughs> what did you see? <laughs> I'll need to run an entrance test for her. Oh, oh, oh. okay. Oh, what is this thing? He said you're going to write exam. No, 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 it's not necessarily an examination. It's just an oral test. I ask her questions, she answer me, and that's all. Eh, uh, uh, um, sir, <laughs> I don't really think uh, that oral question <laughs> is a good idea. I think I would prefer you should just write something down on the paper. Let her answer so I can mark her. No, that, 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 that would be very, very, that would take time. Look, it doesn't take all that. It's just a minute time, and then we'll wrap it up. And then we'll jump right into the admission proper. Okay. So, young lady, are you ready? Yes, sir. It's okay. Just a quick one. Assuming I enter inside my room and find 50 million naira on top of my bed, if you were to be in my shoes, what will you do? Sir, the 50 million is your own or somebody kept it today? I don't know. I don't know. I just opened my door and then 50 million naira became visible right on top of my bed. Now tell me, if you were in my shoes, what will you do? Sir, it's not possible. Huh? Not possible what? Sir, you don't have 50 million now. And somebody cannot come and My friend, it's an assumption. An ordinary assumption. Assuming I walk into my room and I found 50 million naira on my bed. If you wear my shoes, what will you do? <laughs> okay. Sir, you said assuming you walk into your room. Yes. And 50 million is on your bed. Uh-huh. If I'm in your shoe, what will I do? Go ahead, yes. What will you do if you wear my shoes? Okay. So if I'm in your shoe, eh? I'll bite that your big toe. Mm. <laughs> I'll bite it very, very well until you fall down faint. <laughs> then I'll come out from your shoe and carry the money and go to my house. <laughs> what? Eh, <laughs> nah. What kind of ignoramus, nincompoop, blockheaded, low mentality person do you have as a child? Do you think you can literally be in my shoes? How can you get there? Who will put you there? Is that person a fool? I mean, that's just a figure of speech. That's just a figure of ironic speech. Wait, Pasien, you cannot just open your door and see 50 men on your bed. Huh? <laughs> How will you get there? Who's going to put it there? In this economy, is that person a fool? See, please, but that's not figure of ironic speech. Oh. That is figure of impossible speech. I'm dreaming of 15 million naira. I'm going home. 
<laughs> Not only 50 million naira, a 50 million bitcoin. <laughs> Shouting anyhow. Guy, you'll be a beer like don't let it brush. <laughs> so I told you, it's not good to allow this girl talk. <laughs> I'm just go ahead and feel this one, so I like your school. Good morning, class. Good morning, sir. <laughs> How are you doing? We are fine, sir. As you can see, I'm not here alone. I'm here with your teacher and uh, a professor. Professor Bums from the Ministry of Education. Please put your hands together for him. Um, Professor Bums is from the Ministry of Education. And he's here to prepare your mind towards the upcoming state academic quiz. Put your hands together for yourselves. Um, over to you, sir. Right, over thank you, you very sir. much. Good morning, class. Good morning, sir. Yes, nice to meet you. How are you all doing? Yeah. Yes, as you've heard from your principal, I am Professor Bombs, aka Encyclopedia. Thank you very much. Yes, as you can see, with me in my hand is a symbol of excellence. An award that will be going to the brightest student who will emerge as the winner in the upcoming state academic quiz. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So I am here to briefly and briskly bring to your knowledge. Good morning, sir. Prince Good morning. Young woman, you are late. Why? I'm sorry, sir. No. You see, I asked you are late. Why? And she said she's sorry. Is that the right answer to the question? No. Good. Now, young woman, I will ask you again. You are late. Why? Okay, sir. My house is far from the school. So when I was coming, there was hold up on the road. No! That is not good enough reason. What happens to waking up early? What happens to taking your bath early so you can beat the time? But I said I'm sorry now. No! That is not a tangible reason for you to be late. Don't tell me you're sorry. Now, I will ask you again for the last time. Hmm. Okay. Young girl, you are late. Why? Because I'm the best student in this class. <laughs> <laughs> How? Eh? Uh-huh. I'm good and good things take time. <laughs> Close your mouth, yeah. Eh, uh, so sorry, sir. So sorry, sir. Uh, I will handle that, eh? Oh, yeah. Go that way and go and kneel down. Go there. No, 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 no. It's okay. It's okay. I I like this one. I like you. You're smart, huh? I don't know. Anyway, let's play a game. I will ask you three simple questions. And if you get them correctly, you will not serve your punishment. And you'll be awarded a scholarship from the state ministry of education is that okay okay very good but if you don't answer my questions correctly you will serve your punishment and you'll be disqualified from participating in the upcoming state academic quiz is that okay 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 now what is the square root of 76? The square root of 76 is 8.7. Hmm. What is the capital of Japan? The capital of Japan is Tokyo. Okay. What is the relationship between Coulomb's law and Lenz law? You see, I thought as much. The answer is nothing. But I did not say anything now. Kami, she's right. She's true. She got it. No, 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 no. That doesn't count. You're late. You're, you're late to school. Go, go and save your punishment. Uncle Professor, I want to ask you a question. <laughs> okay, go on. And if you not answer this my question, you stop being a professor. You resign for Ministry of Education. <laughs> you announce my school as the winner of the quiz. <laughs> I 
and I will not start my punishment. <laughs> Young girl, what makes you think I cannot answer your question? Mind you, I am Professor Bombs, aka Encyclopedia. As far as life is concerned, there is no question that is beyond and above my intellectual capacity. I do not know. Bring it on. Principal, if this uncle did not answer my question well, I was going to have the quiz. Okay. That means I'm the winner of the quiz, I'll take this award to my house. Then I'll not serve my punishment again. No. Uh, excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Uh, please, uh, let's just let this one slide. Let's just forget about this thing. No, 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 no. Don't say that. Sir, sir, th- th- there's a way we handle... <laughs> I will oh. have you know that I am a certified professor. Okay. I am the AKA Encyclopedia. I am an intellectual colossus. Mm. Okay. Please, bring it on. And to please go live on Facebook so that the world will bear me witness. Okay, I'm live now. Okay. Yesterday, I used a knife to tear the chair in my father's parlor. And my father saw me and asked me, why did I tear it? And I said, I'm sorry. Then he did not flog me. Why? Uh, well, uh, probably because you were remorseful. No. Uh, um, because he's your father. No. Uh, uh, so what is the answer? Because I was holding a knife and I not to use it. <laughs> it's common sense. <laughs> My people, we have won the quiz, Now this day to quiz, want to take your break tomorrow. Tomorrow I'll see you in school. <laughs> no problem. Okay, bye. Uh, you can go. You know only encyclopedia is aka Oxford Dictionary. <laughs> uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, you know that agreement is agreement, and as it is now, you have just uh, <laughs> lost your job. <laughs> <laughs> and don't have a mass teacher in this school. So in case you are interested, you can uh, apply in person. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie, I hope you got uh, this last part on camera. Hey, so I'm sorry, sir. Wait, wait. You mean you didn't get this part on camera? Um, I'm very sorry, sir. Hey, you didn't get this part on camera? I'm very sorry, sir. You are fired! Hey, <laughs> sir. Rubbish! Oh my God, I'm finished, though. <laughs> <laughs> to really work hard if you want to make it in life. When I was growing, it was a bit difficult, but I had to try. When I was in secondary school, I worked really hard, I had to pass my assignments, I had to pay attention so I could make it, and I graduated with good grades. I made it into the university, and as you can see today, I'm a teacher. I'm proud of myself, but I'm still working hard because in future, I want to be a billionaire. Just like my uncle. Success? What did you say? You say you want to be a billionaire. So I say just like my uncle. Which of your uncle? My uncle K. Brown. Wow. Really? Yes. So, where does this year Uncle K. Brown stay? He lives with me. He lives with you? Yes. Can I meet him? Mm, why? Nothing. I just want to meet with him. Is there anything wrong with it? Mm, okay, I'll tell him. Are you sure? Yes. Thank you. So as I was saying, students, you need to work real hard if you want to make it in life. Now come out and lay down. Come out and 
I'm going home. So when can I meet your uncle? I'll ask him today and get back to you. Are you sure? Yes, I will. Okay, you can go. Be a good girl. Alright, bye bye. Success, please come. Please help me give this to your uncle. Okay. Tell him it's a gift from your auntie. Make sure you give him more. Alright. Success, how are you? Where is your headset? I gave it to my uncle. You gave it to your uncle? Yeah. So am I meeting your uncle today? Or oh, then today you meet him on Monday. On Monday? Yeah. Mm. Okay. You can go. Success. Okay, good afternoon. Good afternoon. You already back from school? Yes. Mm-hmm. Uncle, do you want that bean that was about to sour? Yes, I warmed it. I even added pepper, thyme, and some other beautiful spices. If it tastes the, the thing is delicious. Okay, that's what I'm going to eat now. Okay, no problem. Go inside and eat. But remember for me, I've not eaten. No. Success! What are you doing here? Is this where you live? Yes. Success! Who is this? This is my auntie. Oh, your auntie. Auntie, good afternoon. Where is your uncle? This is my uncle. No. Where is your uncle that is a billionaire? Hey, uh-uh. I don't have any billionaire uncle. Wait. Success. You told me your uncle is a billionaire. Me? Hey, success. Please, which of your uncle is a billionaire? Oh, my uncles are poor. <laughs> they don't have shishi. But success, when I told you I wanted to be a billionaire, you said just like your uncle. Okay. Until that time, you said you want to become a billionaire. Then I now say like my uncle because you want to become a billionaire too in the future. <laughs> it's not true. <laughs> hey, my phone, my electric scooter, my headset. Where are they? <laughs> okay, success. Is this the auntie that has been giving us all those things? Yes. <laughs> auntie, thank you very much. I've actually sold out those things. <laughs> That's the money we'll be using to feed ourselves all this oh, while. No. Uh, thank you very much. Eh? Uh, but when are you giving us another gift? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a mouth is a billionaire. <laughs> That's why you'll be giving us those gifts. See, <laughs> Auntie, is someone speaking English? You listen. If you don't understand, do you ask question before you can fall your hand in public because of common English? <laughs> yeah, billionaire, your body is that shaking. I'm not saying it. God, I can't believe I fell for this. Auntie, success told me that you like me. <laughs> <laughs>